Alright, guys, back here in episode number two, Resident Evil 3 Remake. And this here is Carlos from Resident Evil 5, and we are playing as Jill Valentine, which is pretty awesome. So, enjoy this game, and, uh, okay. yeah. This fine young lady could use our help. Carlos. You didn't even think to ask fine young lady her name? She is an elite operative of RPD, Special Tactics and Rescue Service. Her name is something Valentine. It's Jill. Nice to meet you, Jill. I am UBCS, platoon leader Mikhail Viktor. My team was sent here to rescue civilians. Right. How's that going for you? The city is completely cut off, isolated. Most of the hundred thousand civilians will wind up dead. Uh, correction, undead. My platoon has suffered serious losses. Just keeping them alive is more than I can manage. Well, you can thank your corporate overlords for that. Yes. Well, we are doing all we can. If we can get this subway train moving, we can evacuate some survivors. But we need help. My men cannot do this alone. All right. I'm in. But I am on their side, not yours. Oh, hey. It's cool. We all want the same thing. Thank you, Joe. All right, super cop. Here you go. We can use this to stay in contact. I know what a radio is. Okay, first things first. We need to get you geared up. Head up to street level. You'll find supplies there. All right. Hey, Captain, they really took a chunk out of you. <laughs> Nothing that I will miss. Yes, we have a map. Finally. Uh, the map screen is useful for more than just your current location and surroundings. It can also show you any points of interest in items you have found and picked up. Okay, I think we can uh, move it around like, like so. Which is kind of weird because uh, what do we have up here? With our, our inventory, and we have files, Jill's report, uh, the investigation notes, message from a colleague, and the unsealed envelope. But we have, yeah, we can we can read them like that. That's that's pretty pretty cool. We can go back. Like that. Yeah, that, that's the tutorial. What's that? Making use of the map. Yeah, I think we just read that. That's the building part. We can also do that with Y and C, but we can also do it with our mouse here. So, mouse is better than uh, keyboard. Keybinds, but the keybinds are pretty quick as well as, as the mouse here. So. We have Q for our inventory, press Q again for our, f our map here. Uh, we are here, That that's us. Here we have a uh, search completed. The color blue here is this color here, which means search completed. The red color means currently searching. And different map probably out here not sure or this or this area here different map not sure we can uh, zoom in with the mouse wheel if anybody's playing this with um, keyboard and mouse we can uh, reset like that 
and we can close it. And to open it is the M key on the keyboard. What is that? Get above ground. So I think we have to go through here. We can close that with the with the right mouse button, probably. So but what I don't like is uh, this. Okay, we, we can't. Uh, can we save the game or does that game have auto save? I'm still not sure about that one. Turn to the game, what happens if we quit? We can load the game. Um, yeah, I think I think the game has auto save because we can't save it. So. Okay, if we turn it that way, she will walk that way. Turn it that way, she will walk that way. That way. I gotta figure something out in, in the controls here. Uh, controls. Cursor. What's this here? Uh, camera. Uh, when aiming, when aiming, let's uh, turn that up a bit. Okay, the display. What is this? Uh, field of view. Just the field of view. Controller. Okay, let's uh, go back. Yeah, that's a lot better. I think we have to go out here. Let's check the map here real quick. Where are we now? We are... What, what does it tell us? Get above ground, okay, so we're probably going to have to head up in this direction. Okay, the cannibal murder a complete digest. Okay, in the grey of the morning, September 25th, the frantic caller telephone you. That's, that is the Raccoon Police Department, RPD. So, what are you. What? Who done it? <laughs> okay. We can close that up. We can also go back in here and read it. In here. Like so. Uh, files. That is probably under. Under download, yeah. Downtown, sorry. Under downtown, not download. Under downtown it is. Yeah. Do we have here? Yeah, I still, still don't like that turning here. It's, uh, no, I don't know if you can. Uh, if it's different with the aim assist. Jill, it's me again. You topside yet? Working on it. So, what's the plan? The old tanks got me clearing the tracks. You mind getting the subway infrastructure back online? And how do I do that? Let's start by restoring power. I'll navigate you to the substation once you hit the main road. Copy that. 
Let's do this fast. All right, we are practically here, and I think that light is facing forward, so we are walking forward here. Alright, uh, let's uh, equip Jira with the knife. Purpose. I wish we could pick up with, uh, with E instead of that mouse button. Alright, cool. Herbs are here. A red herb. Native to Arkley Mountains, it can be used as is. Okay, so y if you're injured, you can uh, heal yourself up with this pink or red herb. I call it a red herb because all the other herbs in Resident Evil are red, as far as I know. You have red, yellow, and green, but these look pink to me. I wonder, do we uh, do we get um, a box that we can uh, put our stuff in, like a suitcase or something? Got some herbs here. Got some really, really cool stuff here, by the way. Okay, what do we have here? Gunpowder. More gunpowder, more herbs. Um, let's see if we can. Uh, what's this? So, no, some items can be combined with other items, either to free up a slot or to create something. New, okay. Uh, we can combine. Yes, that worked. Uh, a standard grade gunpowder. Combine two of these to create handgun ammo. Two of these, two of them. Okay, let's uh, grab another one. Uh, combine with this guy here. Oh, okay. We have here handgun ammo. That's pretty cool. Nice. I like that idea. It's pretty awesome. Let's uh, grab that one. But I don't think we can uh, combine. No, we can't. <laughs> what does that? Can we turn it? Yes, we can. Look at that. How cool is that? A green herb native to Arkley Mountains, it will restore a small amount of health. Just like the um, the green herbs in the other Resident Evil games, so... Pretty cool. So two times gunpowder combination will give us handgun ammo. I wonder what else we have to combine to give us other types of ammo. What's in here? Ah, uh, what's that? Um, what, what can we put in there? Wait, what is that? Is that our suitcase or... Answer. That's our suitcase. Uh, examine. What, 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 what? Um, okay, space, space bar is uh, backwards. We can go backwards like that with the space bar. Um, she doesn't do the protection like Eaton Winters does. In Resident Evil Village, yeah, she goes back like that, so...
Yeah, I, I'm not sure what that does. Kind of, kind of, kind of stuck on that one now. Um. Ooh, what am I con confirming? What's that? Kite Brothers Railway. It almost looks like I could get this yeah. working if I plug in the right whatever it is. Okay, I think we need more that. We don't have those shirts. I call them shirts for now, so. We can save the game, can we? Yes, we can! How cool is that? We can save the game right here, and it does auto-save. It does auto-save, but we can uh, save it here at the same time. So that means uh, we can... We can uh, exit the game without uh, losing a game save. Downtown subway ticket gate, reactive power at the... or uh, reactivate the power at the subway station. 16 of the 3rd, 2024. That is probably the real date up here. Because today is the 16th and the year 2024, so. And we have 2207, now it's 2209, so that's pretty much. I'm gonna probably play. For the most part, I'm gonna overwrite the save game here. I won't be saving up in here. I'll overwrite the saves for, for the most part, anyway, so. Uh, next page. What? 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 What is next page? One. Ah, okay. And return. So we saved our game right here, so we can uh, exit the game. Uh, I still don't like that turning here with with the mo with the mouse here. That I still, still don't like it. I mean. When you're walking left and right, uh, you should be able to turn the character like that. Like when you're walking left and right, instead of doing it with the mouse, she will turn with the camera. And that's not separate without the camera. You have to turn the camera with the, with the mouse to get her to walk in the direction you want her to. I don't like that very much. In village it was uh, different. Here you have to... Let's uh, take a herb. Let's uh, heal her up. Alright, that's a little bit better. Yeah, like I was saying. In village you can uh, turn the character with the camera. Here you have to turn the camera with the mouse. And then uh, turn the character in the direction you're walking. Like, turn the camera that way, walk that way, turn the camera this way. Like so. If I walk left and right, uh, the camera ain't turning. I, I have to figure out how to do, how to, how to do that. Second here. Um, options it was. Not the controls, uh, it's it's gotta be camera. Controller sensitivity, but it's not it's not uh, display. Let me know in comments below how to do that. Aiming aiming what's the radical deceleration, what is that? Display. Okay. 
Okay, it won't let me do it for some reason, so... Let's uh, play on here. We've got 10 minutes left until the 30 minute mark. What's this? The UPCS uh, Herb Field Manual. There's no place in the UPCS for pipsqueaks who crawl back and back to base every single time they get scratched up. You want somebody to kiss your boo-boo, go someplace else. Okay, here in the big leagues we mix our own meds. So get these recipes memorized, okay? Alright, high potency mixture. Green herb times two. Maximum potency mixture. Green herb and red herb are three times green herbs, okay? That's pretty awesome. First, it's spray. We know this from other Resident Evil games. I, I think I don't have to memorize the herb portion. See, so you can mix uh, green and yellow, and you can mix green and red. You can also mix uh, green, yellow, and red. Uh, the first it spray uh, can't make these yourself. Grab them. Yeah, that should do it. Let's uh, let's go back to this again. You can mix two green herbs. I think you can also mix... Um, I don't know if you can mix two red herbs or two yellow herbs. I've never tried that before. But you have to mix the, the tree. Uh, yellow, green and red. You can also mix here a green and red. Or three times green. I know what to do. Alright, you, you can uh, look at that in here as well, in the inventory, here. That is under, under downtown apartment, yeah, we got the tutorials, we got these three here, so... I'm just gonna have to get used to the game, I guess. Okay, um, let's uh, check out the box. Uh, store, okay, we're gonna put that away. Can we take it back out? The survival knife. Take out, that's how you do it, okay? So let's uh, do that again. Um, store. Then it's in, in the box. Open up the box. Click on the survival knife or whatever it is. Go up here, click on take out. And it's back in your inventory here. Alright, that's uh, pretty neat. I might keep keep that knife actually. And how do we do that? I wonder if there's another another way of doing it. It's uh yeah, you can uh, press the escape button on the keyboard to be able to close up the, um... No, that's not what I wanted. Okay, let's see if we can uh, store that in here. Yes, we can. Take it back out. Click on it. And it's back in your inventory. Alright. Let's uh, save it up. Override the data? Yes. Okay, cool. Let's just see what else we can find in here. Before we call this video finished, we already had a look at that, but we need the shards. We're gonna have to find the shards for that first to make that work. Still don't know what that is meant to be. Ah, uh, you probably need a need a key for that. Yeah, probably probably need a key to open that up. To equip the gun here. 
Yes, we can we can also use the the mouse wheel to select our weapon. Look at that. How cool is that? We don't we don't have to we don't have to get in here to be able to select our weapon. We can uh, use the mouse wheel. That's pretty cool. And we can do that. That's pretty awesome. Pretty cool. But I still don't like uh, moving around. That's uh, something I have to get used to here in the game. I have to learn how to move around and use the mouse at the same time. No. The heck? More survivors. We've got to get that train moving. A quick step. Uh, space and okay. No, 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 no. I want the quick move is that one, that one, that one, and back. Can we get back in there, I wonder? Yes, we can, because, because I want to save the game. Okay, let's, uh, let's save it. Alright guys, um, that is going to conclude the video. Thanks for watching. I hope you have enjoyed this cool episode. In the next episode, we are gonna get out there. We're gonna do our do our thing. Let's see where we are on the map. I'm still searching. We are missing. We're still missing this here key. That's why it's. What is that? A simple lock. Monument. Okay, we can move it around with our mouse here as well. Okay. So this was episode number two. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to my channel, watch the videos, do all that good stuff, and catch you guys back here in episode number number three. Bye bye.